All of which led me to the elective I reluctantly chose, Psychology 101, an investigation into why people think and feel the way they do. Blech. All right, Thanksgiving weekend approaching, it's a perfect opportunity to observe family dynamics and how our parents, relatives, and siblings affect us. Now, the... yes, Sheldon? I don't find that interesting. Well, tough knuckles, that's the assignment. Now, you'll all be expected to collect data on your family, form a hypothesis, and make a prediction. So you're giving us homework for Thanksgiving? Yes. Oh, boy. Hey, listen. Something came up today that we need to talk about. What's that? I may have a shot at a better job. Oh, George, they're finally going to make you head coach? Yeah, better than that. Special teams coach, University of Tulsa. In Oklahoma? That is where they're keeping Tulsa these days. No need to be lippy. And I've got my job at the church, and then there's Mom. Am I supposed to just walk away from her? No, what you're supposed to do is support my efforts to improve my... Listen, I'm gonna need your help with something. Is it about money? Nope. Then I'm your gal. What's up? George is up for a coaching job at the University of Tulsa. Tulsa? Ugh. During dinner, maybe you could express how devastating it would be to be away from the kids. Well, I don't think I use the word devastating. That doesn't sound like me. Okay, well, use whatever word you want. I might use heartbroken. Good, use that. Yeah, maybe. You got a thesaurus. You're making a sandwich? I'm a creature of habit. <laughs> hey, why don't we all go around the table and say what we're thankful for? Come on, really? Yes, really. I'll start. Um, I am so thankful to be able to watch my grandchildren grow up. And I can't even tell you how much it means to me that y'all live right across the street. And if y'all weren't, I would just be heartbroken. OK, moving on. George? Well, <clears throat> I'm thankful to share Thanksgiving dinner with my family, of course. I'm also thankful for this fine country we live in and all the opportunities it provides us, especially when those opportunities come once in a lifetime and require taking a small risk and believing in one another. We're really going to do this now? Hey, you started it with all that school system crap. OK, that's enough of this. Nobody's moving anywhere. Let's just have a nice, quiet dinner. That's it? You're, you're going to make the decision for me? I'm making a decision for us. All right, then. Where are you going, George? George! Spending the Thanksgiving weekend working in my family's convenience store. I observed my father and mother working from 6 o'clock in the morning till 10 o'clock at night. My hypothesis was that economic advancement for immigrant families is more important than celebrating a holiday where people eat until they pass out in front of the TV. All right, Tam, well, based on your observations and hypothesis, were you able to make a prediction? Yes. At some point, my father would die prematurely from stress, and my mother would come live with me where she will constantly disapprove of my hot, blonde, American wife. OK. I think we all learned something there. Uh, thank you, Tam. Uh, Mr. Cooper, you're up. Beginning on Wednesday night, I observed my parents arguing over the possibility of us moving to Tulsa, Oklahoma. Ugh. The argument escalated, and then my father stormed out and bought a Fiero. And then I went to my Meemaw's and slept in my underwear! That's it. I've wasted my life. 